So you guys could tell that I didn't fall off my chair actually, right? That was just a... I was trying to convey exactly what it felt like when I saw that. I woke up quite early. We have a good time difference between Canada and Australia. And I woke up quite early to a string of messages on my phone. And I mean, I'm talking a lot. I think it was like a 99 plus inbox of just people being like, Bro, check out Chris Ramsey's latest video. You have to see it. And I was like, huh. I went on there. I always watch Chris's videos anyway, but I, I jumped on and watched it, started watching it, and I watched it the whole way through, and halfway through it. Do you remember the guy who I like, I react to his videos sometimes? He's got like, a, he cracks a whip, he's got long hair, he's like Australian, he's pretty good with his hands, like really good sleight of hand guy. I don't watch your videos. Yeah, yeah, I think so. <laughs> Jason Marr, really nice guy, he's starting a 365. Yeah? Yeah, with magic. Wow. Video a day, 300. 65 days. This idea is not uniquely my own at all. The person that I saw do it first was Eric the player. <laughs> this guy had an amazing Me. thing. A lot of people have tried. And that's it. Like I'm subscribed to this guy. You guys should go subscribe to him too. I'll leave the link below. He's actually a really good magician, I, and I got to support. Like you know. Yeah. Reach out if you want support or advice. So, so they actually took the time to endorse or shout out my 365 day project. This is crazy. We are only up to day number 10. And what an insane amount of response to even have some of the big dogs, the top dogs, like Chris Ramsey and Eric LeClaire mentioning my channel is insane. I was not prepared. That was a huge, that's a huge thing. I'm rambling. <laughs> Chris Ramsey, I've mentioned it once before that he just takes the time to, to hype up even the smaller channels. You know, he mentions people and he helps them out. And, uh, but this is a whole new level of, uh, of that. So from the bottom of my heart, I want to say thank you so much, Chris Ramsey and Eric LeClaire for mentioning my channel and, uh, and sending me some hype. Ended up gaining like an additional 300 subscribers since that video's been, no, 400, 500. <laughs> and that's insane. So first of all, welcome to everyone that's come here from Chris Ramsey's channel. I'm sorry that my, my content quality isn't quite as great, but I am still new to this whole experience. So I hope that you guys enjoy it anyway. And uh, it's 365 days of magic. You guys are now part of the 365 day squad. <laughs> and I'm, I'm super glad you're all here. And I'm super grateful that this is becoming a thing. I honestly thought that I was going to do this challenge. I was going to gain like a couple followers here and there. I never expected this. This is beyond my wildest imagination. <laughs> so thanks to Chris and thanks to all of you. So yeah. <laughs> Yahtzee! So I think it's only fair that today's magic trick for day number 10 is actually the very first trick that I posted under Chris Ramsey's subreddit. And coincidentally, it's the very first trick of mine that he featured on his channel. If you watch Chris's videos religiously, that was a tongue twister, which you should, then you would know what that trick is. But I'm going to do it again anyway. It's a great trick. It's actually one of my personal favorite tricks. I learned this from my teacher. So I had a teacher in magic when I was street performing, James Hessler. Brilliant magician, funny guy. He taught me this while we were drinking around a bar one day, and he also gave me a copy of the book that it was published in, The Drawing Room Deception. I think you guys will really like this trick, so let's roll the stinger, and let's do a magic trick. Alright, here it is. The very first card trick I ever did on Chris Ramsey's subreddit, okay? Check this out. I'm going to fold this card in half, straight down the middle, give it some nice creases, and then I'm going to fold it down the second middle, okay? Very important that you fold it down both middles. Now when I unfold the card, you'll note that I have these nice creases to tear along, okay? So I'll just tear down those. You can actually see as well, that is genuinely torn, okay? And now it really is half. I can also take the card, tear it into quarters. And now this is actually where the trick begins, okay? Because with what, one, two, three, four quarters of card, two are gonna go in the mouth, and two are going to stay right here at the fingertips. Check it. I will restore this card right in front of you in high definition, just a quick wave, boom, the card is restored. That's number one. Number two, no messing around, let's just get it done. Boom, there it is. Number two is now restored. 
The last piece is hands down the most difficult because there are two edges to restore. And like I said, this is in high definition, man. This camera is not forgiving me at all if I screw up. So if I don't get this right, you will see. Because I'll be damned if I'm filming this trick again. <laughs> and that, my friends, is reformation. Now that trick, believe it or not, took <laughs> way more takes than I thought it would. I think I might have filmed it uh, maybe 40 times before posting that uh, version of it. The only reason I'm telling you this is because uh, I can do that trick 100% of the time live. However, there are small subtleties and tells that on camera uh, don't quite uh, translate as well. Because obviously you can pause, you can rewind, you can... And I, I don't really want to give away this trick. This, this trick is by Guy Hollingsworth. It's a brilliant trick and it's really worth picking up the book and learning it yourself. I don't want I don't want to be like exposing it by accident by performing it poorly so I had to redo it again and again until it looked great. <laughs> but I mean that's the issue with doing magic on camera right? Even if you can nail a trick you get the most amazing reactions in real life for some reason on camera it can just be not as good. But anyway, I really hope you guys enjoyed that trick anyway. I want to say thank you to everyone that's come over from Chris's channel to join me here. And I want to say thank you to Chris one more time because this is uh, crazy. I really never thought my goal for the year was to crack 1k. And now here I am making videos for a thousand of you. <laughs> so anyway guys, with that, that is day number 10. I love your faces and I will see you guys tomorrow for day number 11.